All right, welcome back. So Heather and I ended up getting this all sheeted in. We had to make it go on a bit of an angle to get the scaffold a little closer to the wall. But I think we're good. Now remember this scaffold is all just temporary. It's going to get removed once we get this whole wall here built and then the roof done and then it uh, house wrapped, strapped and the siding on it. And the siding we're going with is the same as what's on the house. It's inexpensive for us to make because it's just milling one inch. So we can do that. But if we had to buy roofing steel, like, like siding out of tin, it would be too expensive. Correct the mundo, little one. Yes. Right on. Hope you left your attitude inside today. <laughs> My attitude. <laughs> <laughs> well, we know yours is out here. <laughs> yes, I brought you in, out with me. You force. are my attitude. Hmm? <laughs> hmm? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to give you a measurement. I'm going to set the camera up here on a tripod. Yep. And uh, if, if you can behave, I will let you participate in this video. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's so kind of you. Yeah, I thought so. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'll set the camera up and you pretend you do stuff, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta come down here sometime. <laughs> no, I could sleep up here probably. <laughs> <laughs> well, exactly. Well, you gotta no, sleep. no, I said I could. You I gotta sleep sometime. I said I could. I didn't say I'm going uh, to. Okay, well, we'll see. Okay, no. Lose the attitude. <laughs> <laughs> I think the first thing I had to do was get this straightened out, correct? Okay, I got this done here. So over here, I believe this, yeah, so we're good here. I'm just gonna get right up here. What do you think of that, eh? What do you think of them apples? Hmm? Pretty good. I think so. These are short, these are only like four inch, four and a half inch, I think. Hey. Darn nail kept moving. Pardon me? That nail kept moving. I understand when it does it to you, but for me, it's not supposed to. Yeah, it doesn't really make sense when it happens. It happens to you. I can okay. see that. How'd you like to pass me that Bessie clamp? Do you see where it is? I do. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Somehow, I have to pull this in here. I, uh, if I don't, okay, back this out. Now, is that going to reach down there? Seems like it's going to catch it. It appears to be. Yeah, it should be straightening up the wall a certain amount as well. Because that wall was out a little bit. Pull that down as well. So it goes down fairly tight. If it will. And then what rehammer it? Hmm? Then rehammer it or Yeah. Yeah. I'll put a few more nails in it too along the way here. That's down tight now. Put another one in the center here. Yeah, 
Yeah, so that should have been... Oh, I see. That's okay. I didn't... That has to be pulled in. I didn't put any nails there, so that's good then. Okay, so I will back this out now. That should stay there now. We'll see what it does. Yeah, staying good there. But this here has to be pulled in to be straight. So that goes like this. Pretty straight there. I think I just hit a nail. Yep. I hate when that happens. Okay, I'll just bury it right there. Makes no difference to me. Look you here, done. you. Were you using this hammer? Someone knocked the sights off of it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought the problem was that there were like rubber nails or like plasticine nails. Maybe in your world, not mine, babe. I was trying to help you out. Okay, you're just bad at it. Nope. How about that? Nope. I How about you... them apples? Nope, I think you dropped my hammer. Oh. Knocked the sides out. Mm. I think that's what happened. Here I am trying to help you out. <laughs> Giving you an out. And then you just do When that. you rely on luck, you need an out. But when you're good, you don't. Hmm. <laughs> don't know what to say about that, eh? Whatevs. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I got to say about that. <laughs> With any luck, I don't drop this. And I'm sorry that I'm kind of close. I just don't want to get too close to the edge. Yeah, be careful. We don't have any insurance. Yeah, I know. You gotta get me some of that before you, before you have me fall off the edge. Or get pushed. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. Make it at least make it worth your while. <laughs> What do people you normally pay for peace and quiet nowadays? <laughs> <laughs> That's very rude, Susan. I'll come back and haunt you. How about that? <laughs> you do it while you're alive. <laughs> You take care of me so I can't really complain. For somebody I mean, that can't really complain, you should do it a lot. <laughs> why let a good skill go to waste, Heather? I've been honing that craft for years. Mm -hmm. I don't want to let it go to waste. Yeah. Yeah. Well. <sighs> no. You're almost ready to get to work. <laughs> I need a two by six cut at 41 and three quarters. Well, just a 16th over three quarters. So we're gonna go 13 16 13 sixteenths. Yeah. Okay. Sixteenth over the three quarters. So 41. And a sixteenth over three quarters, or 13 sixteenths, okay? Okay. Brrr. 
how straight is this look now here? A little bit of a wow. Out? All in all, it's not that bad though. I can live with that. I mean, once you get our walkway all the way around, that'll get pulled in. Once we build the walkway inside, that'll be all good. So I just gotta put this piece on here, get this piece put on here, and then I do have to put a little piece of like a two inch or something in here. Just that little section there, it's no big deal. And then I have to start framing in this here. I have to put my, it's under four feet that runs up there. And then once that's up, then I come over here and we do another section. Actually there, I'll start working my way from there and come back is what I will do. Yeah, I'll start framing it from that side and come back. So let's get you on a tripod. I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> so wait, let's see if it, Let's see if it's gonna fit here, okay? Okay, I'll wait here. You would. <laughs> yeah. And then, if it's not good, then I'll take the board back down and, and adjust take, it. And take the blame of cutting it wrong. Like I need to do with your attitude. Whatever, other. Mm hmm. Whatever. Do you remember how long I asked you to cut it at? 41 and 13 sixteenths. Yep. That's what I did. Huh. I don't know. You also said 41 and a sixteenths over three quarters, which I also is the same thing. So I did that. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm questioning my measurements. Oh, so you did it wrong. Yeah, that would be. Oh, sense. I didn't say I did anything wrong at all. Let me just cut a piece off. What? You just want me to cut a little off. So I want you to what? Just cut a little off. Sorry, I was ignoring you. What? I'm not saying it again. I get that in writing? <laughs> there you go. There we go, what? There we go, I was right, I had the measurement perfect. <clears throat> Is that what you were gonna say? You did a good job on the measurement. Does that sound enthusiast enthusiastic? Oh, do I get a gold star? You do. I give you a gold star. Cool. Well, thank you. You're welcome. question is though, would you give me a gold star? Can't hear you, babe. Hold on a minute. I didn't hear a word you said, but yes, I would give you a gold star for cutting out the right lens. Yeah. Good. Okay. But I couldn't hear a word you were saying. Now I'm going to go down and you can just give me the measurement when you're ready. What are you mumbling again? Heather? I said when, okay, I don't even remember now. <laughs> I'm glad it was well thought through. Oh yeah, I said you can give me the measurement. I'm gonna go down and you can give me the measurement when you, when you know what you want. Oh yeah. Mm. 
Oh, yeah. I need one of those little step stools, you know what? Excuse me, what? What's that? What'd you say? I said I need one of those little step stools. Yeah. The scaffold's too high. And this one here I, we built is just a little too low. Mm. Something in between would be just perfect, my darling. <clears throat> hey, that's looking good. Alrighty. Yeah. Do you remember the angle I need? Uh, was it 45? I believe it was a 30. Okay. Correct the mundo. You know what? I think you're right. I think it was 30. What's that? I think you're right. I think it was 30. Wow. I usually always am, but it's okay. Thank you, anyway. <laughs> it kills me to say you're right. <laughs> I know it does. Three I'm inch on the short side. The short side? Three inch on the short side, yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> say that again. Three inch on no, the... No, no. I heard you go, K. Okay. What's that? I heard you... Maybe I heard you wrong, but I thought you said K. Okay. said, okay. <laughs> so I thought. Okay. Can you figure that out? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. 100% sure? Yeah. So three inch. Yeah, but I think that's going to be on the long side the way you're cutting that, right? Is it? Yeah, pretty sure you'd have to have the... Uh, let me see here. See, when you make that cut, it's going to be on the long side, right? So let me give you a measurement on the long side then, okay? Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Listen, Mr. Del Vecchio. Four and an... Uh, yeah, let's go... Let me see here. Go four inch on the long on the long side. Oh yeah. Remember go real slow, multiple cuts or else it's going to end up sliding that board. Thanks for the thanks for the reminder cuz I did forget about that. Hey, you're welcome. So I appreciate that. I was a beginner once. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, even when I'm thanking you and being okay, all humble, it's you okay. can't. It's okay, junior operator. Let's go.
lot of moisture in that fresh lumber we cut, eh? That looks good, Heather. Yeah, so it's every and every time I do a do a new cut, it leaves like a what do you call it? Like a ridge. See that? Yeah. It's fine. Okay. It looks good. It'll be fine. Okay. Let's see how it looks here. I mean, it's either going to work or it won't, right? Yeah. We'll do one of two things. I'm pretty sure with my expert knowledge and advice, you've probably got it pretty close to being right. Look at that. Hey. Hey now. It worked. What? I said it worked. Yeah. Yep, it is good. Now somehow, Heather. Yeah. Can you bring up a couple long screws? Yes. And the cordless drill? Yep. Because there's no way I'm gonna be able to nail this and expect it not to move. Okay. How many screws, just two? No, you better bring up four. Four, four of the long four inch. Yeah, okay, and then? And the drill. The drill, and that's it? Yeah, you know the drill. <laughs> huh? I said yes, you know the drill. I do. <laughs> you made it funny. All right. I said you made it funny. I do. You're welcome. See, I can't nail that there, but it has to go right there, so. Check that out, eh? Check out them apples. I mean, this one doesn't really matter too, too much, but. It's really just where I have something to frame up the other end. And then I'll have to put a little piece in here, but that's fine. It'll be okay. Go back down, you can let me know. I sure will. Mm hmm. I'm going to give you a measurement. Okay, I'm going to get you to square that up, okay? Okay, just a second. And cut me a two by six that's uh, two inch long. Well, let's go two. Let's go two and say, oh, 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 oh. easy there, fella, easy. Do you want the angle on the one end? No, no, square. Just square? Yeah, I just need it two inch. Okay. I think I actually have one right here. What? That I can do. Yeah, see, I need it, the two inch, I need it to, for on the end right here. I need it right in here. So I'll stand it straight up and I'll nail it in there. And then this screw can come down and hold that. Again. This one's got a, 
This one's got a crack down it. I don't think that's gonna be good. No good. Abort, abort. Yeah. Oh, that's dangerous on the fingers. I would yeah. cut it out of a long piece, Heather. Oh, well, that's the whole reason I'm using this. No good, no good, no good. No good, no good, no good. What's wrong with that one right there? What's wrong with it? Oh, I, nothing. I just figured if I could use some scraps. You know what happens when you figure, right? Uh, I don't know. What? Um, I don't know. I'm sure there's something there. Make sure there's no wane on it. So There is wane on it. Well, cut out a spot that don't have wane. The whole thing has wane. Oh, no, but then if I cut that off, then... You, then you can redo it, yes. Oh, right. Or you know what? You could go get another two by six from around the corner. Right? You are one picky person. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. Well, if I didn't care how it was done, I'd let you do it. <laughs> you didn't care how it was done? I'd let you do it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? I said, <laughs> <laughs> you're hilarious. <laughs> oh, and yet I wasn't trying to be. <laughs> that, that looks like something better. What's that? That looks like a better looking two by six. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty hot. What's that? I said, yeah, it's pretty hot. Oh, I didn't say it was into it or anything. I, just huh? I didn't mean it that way, but whatever. Oh, oh, whatever. Yeah, me neither. Spin it however you want. If it's Two weird, inch. me neither. Two inch. And if you're cutting from the other side, you wouldn't have to worry I about know, trying just, to look on the other side of the blade. I just know that. Saying. I know that. Then I would turn the saw around. I will do that after I cut this one, okay? I will move it. After you botch this cut, okay. Botch this cut. I don't know who said that. Does the guy standing behind me say that? Huh? Nothing, just keep cutting. No, what'd you say? I don't remember. I said the guy behind me said that, not me. Huh. See, that way the line is hiding behind the blade. The guy beside you seems like... No, I said that way the line is hiding beside the blade, but if you took that saw, turned around I... so you're facing out... I understand, and I'm going to, okay? Oh. Jeez. Get off my back already. <laughs> I didn't mean Pass that. me that and go lay down by your dish. How's that? How's that? I don't know. We'll find out. Moment of truth. Let me see here. Well, you cut it right, but my measurement was off. Huh? Nothing. No, I said it looks great. It fits perfectly. Hammer that in as much as I can. Oh yeah, perfect, Heather. Are you being sarcastic or serious? No, I said my measurement was off a little bit. But I didn't want that to go to your head or anything. I'll just put it in like that. Whatever.
Perfect. Good. Hold that in as well. Now, from the two foot mark, back, exactly there, look at that. Okay, Heather, I need that level if you don't mind. Okay. I need Neville the level. It would be over here beside the truck where we leaned up against the OSB last time we used it. Just saying. I have a pretty idea where you want to put that too now. <laughs> <laughs> you said it. I'm a lady. I would never... I'm not going to say that myself. <laughs> yeah, okay. Who are you trying to kid now? What's that? I said, who are you trying to kid now? <laughs> So there to there would be here. That's where the one side's going to be. So I'm going to take a measurement here. Go from here up to there. Are you ready? Yeah, just tell me what it is you need. 41 and a, oh, 14 and a quarter long side. You know what? You better go. Nah, you better go 14 and an eighth long side. 14 and an eighth the long side. You got her, baby. You got her. Yeah, so now I just drew a line. I think you can see it. Maybe you can't see it. It's, it is hard to see, though. But as you've seen there, I think you've seen, I just took a level. Since this is two foot two foot on center from outside here to here. That's where I frame this up, two foot on center. So I just went with a level and I went from here, from this side up, put a line here with the level. And then that is two foot on the long side. So toe, toe is the long side. Down here on the short side would be heel when it's cut on an angle. So that's how, yeah, heel to toe, but I just tell Heather the long side. That way it's easier. Right, Heather? Yep. I'm sure you know the difference between heel and toe when I say that, but yeah. I think it's easier if I just say short and long side, right? Yep. But you did that right, but then you put the saw on the wrong, you put that stand on the opposite side again. The stand should be on the other side. Because your be? line's on the opposite side of the blade again. No, it's... Yes, it is. Oh, it is. Hey. Right? It is. Okay, um, let me just Yeah, because this. you switched. No, no, just switch it, babe. This has to be accurate. Just okay. put your stand on the other side this time. Yeah, you turn the saw around, but the, then you turn the stand, and you just did exactly the same as you did before. There we go. It's okay, Heather. It's a rookie mistake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Might be a little far away if you're going to cut that at 14 inches long. No, I have the, uh, I have the, it marked. I just. Yeah. But the stand, I think, is too high as well. Yeah, it he's... probably is. I, I'm just adjusting because it was, <laughs> the other side's lower, so now I have to adjust it. Okay. Are you good? Actually, it is good. Oh, there you go. You'll find it easier now because the line is on your left side now. Mm -hmm. It's on the right side of the blade that you need. It'll be golden now. Beautiful. Don't throw it. I thought you were going to throw it. <laughs> no. I'm not going to throw it when the camera is there. Oh, I will be. <laughs> Even when I'm here. Oh, and I really love it now that you're sweeping the sawdust off that again. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, hint, hint. <laughs> yeah, well, I got Okay, where's the brush? Well, let me see. I think you used it the last time. So it could be anywhere. That's what I was thinking. I 
saw that. Where the heck did I see it? I don't know, in the, in the old Ford truck down there we're working on. <sighs> oh, guess what? I need you to take off an eighth of an inch. So just 14, not 14 and an eighth. Yep. 14. Actually, you know what? Take off a little bit more than four. Take off a little more than an eighth of an inch. Take off like thickness and a half of the blade. Okay. Roughly, so like three sixteenths. I would say about that. Beauty. Then if you don't mind, I'm going to get you to get my little square as well. I need that right now. Yeah. But you know the little square I have on the mill? Yeah. It's down underneath that one bunk. Okay. If you don't mind. You want that square? And then, so just the square? Just the square, yeah, for now, babe. That will do. Yeah, we gotta take off even more. It's it's I don't know, I think. Yeah, I gotta take off more. Hmm. I don't know why, take off another eighth of an inch. You know what, take off, yeah, another eighth. Here, I'm gonna toss this down to you. Okay. There. Okay, Thank yep. you. Another take off another thickness of the blade, roughly. So right. It's a little more than eight when you cut it, but it's pretty close. Okay. That should do it. So just another thickness of the blade. A little more, just a hair more. Just a hair more. Yeah, it's not. It doesn't have to be exact here. It, it doesn't have to be accurate or exact. Oh. Try that. Thank you. I'm gonna wait here in case it don't fit or it doesn't fit. Hmm. You just hand it to me and I'll bring it back down. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what's going on in this, but it, well, I guess it's fitting now. Let me see here. Well, I am going to get a nail in here and I'll see what it's like. Worst it'll do is lift the roof up on this side. I don't care if it lifts the roof up a little wee bit. That's the problem. I worry about distorting these rafters. But like I said here, it don't really matter. now. I knew you were gonna do that. I 
I mean, if it's not exact, it's not going to be the end of the world here. a bit. The bottom should come out. I mean, once I get the piece up here, it's going to be okay. It's off. Yeah, a fair bit even. But I'm going to go with that. Stick a nail in here. I don't want to move that over any further though. I think I'm going to leave it at that. Stop. Hmm. Wow, guess what I did? I dropped the square in the level. I'll get him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Aren't we a clumsy doodle? <laughs> yeah, you are. Huh? Yes, you are, but I can handle it. Yeah. Thank you. Here Thank you. Go. You're welcome. See what I can do here now. Mm -hmm. Thank you, by the way. Pardon? I said thank you, by the way. You already said thank you, but you're welcome again. Ah. Uh -huh. What is, is this level here? I gotta check that out. I mean, it's off, but only by like a sixteenth of an inch, but this is level. Why is it looking so weird? It is off. It's off a bit, but... Once the OSB's on there, you're not going to notice. Right? Right. So, the four foot mark. So, I'm just going to, I'm just going to minus a little more next time. Just so I know here. Yeah. It is what it is. Now, just to be sure, we're going to go... See, it's got to be sitting here, too. <sighs> Let's go 28, Heather, okay? 28 inches, but on that angle again, eh? Yeah, 30 degrees. Yeah. So 28 on the long side again, but you shouldn't have to change that because it's always going to be 28 on the long side. Except I had to change it to cut. No, no, I mean, uh, the angle's always going to stay the same, I mean. Oh, okay. You're going to have to change it because you're going to have to cut one on an angle, and the next one square, and then one on an angle, the next one square. Yeah. I'm going to take off my hat here and my sweatshirt because it's warming up. Ooh, that was way off. <laughs> What's that? I'm talking to myself. Well, I guess that's no different than the other time. Huh? Nothing. No, what'd you say? I said that's no different than any other time, I guess. I do it a lot. Uh, 28? Yeah. 28 right on. The long side. It's always going to be the long side, babe. All right. Because you can't cut on that from the short side, I don't think. Yeah, I think you're right, too. Well, don't think it. Just know it. <laughs> Just know I'm always right. Mm. Tell I'm wrong, and we won't admit it. That's how it goes.
It's gonna be this one gonna be it here. Okay, so I'm not sure if this one's gonna fit, so just hold on a second there. Yep. I'll wait. No, you see, because, because, What's, oh yeah, that should be two inch, two, two inches out. That's why that looks funny, because I gotta put a two inch on there, so I gotta leave that at least two inches here. Ah. That has to be two inches out there. I knew that at the bottom one, but for some reason, I got that one on a bit of an angle, because there is only yeah, so that's got to come out a lot. So that there, two inches there. So this here, it has to come out quite a bit more. We've got not quite two inches there either. Six, because that is three, four, five, six, seven. So it's going to be this way an inch for future references. That's what's going on right now. Ah, that's okay. I can, that'll work. Will it? Uh, here, Heather, you know what I'm going to get you to do? Hmm. How long, how long do you have? So how long are those, 10 feet down there? Uh, yeah, they're 10 just, foot. Okay, there's square 10 foot me. and there's 8 foot. Okay, just take a 10 foot and square it up for me, okay? Okay. And then pass it out to me. I should have done this right away. Do you want it 10 foot on the nose or? No, no, no. Just, just cut, cut just it square as long up a 10 as you can, yeah, and then pass it up to me. Okay. So, yeah. Just square it up in the end. It doesn't matter how long it is or how much longer it is because that's what I should have done in the first place to get my my measurements and my angles, well the angle's right, but it's the placement of those that can be wrong and you're about to see this as soon as I put that piece in. I have to finish framing in the outside of the uh, rafters, Heather. You know what I mean? I think so, yeah. Yeah, so if you can square that up as much as you can, that would be great. Then I have to unlock these. I may have to redo those ones I put up. I'm not really too happy with what I did there. But if that's the case, I'll do it. Pretty sure I messed up on those ones. Yeah. They may have to be taken out and moved. So we finished sheeting in a scaffold this morning. That's what we did. Finished building it and sheeting it in. That's what we did. It's gotta be square. Yeah, I know. Okay. okay. I'm still setting everything up. What's that, babe? I still I'm still setting everything up. Okay. need these I'll put these over here somewhere
Yep, yep. That's what I did wrong. Yeah, bottom one I think is going to be okay. I can work with that, but the top one I think is going to have to be moved out. I might have to knock that back out and straighten it up. I think that part's okay. Yeah, this here has just got to come out. That one I don't think I have to mess with. It, it should be good. I'm thinking so. I have to do it this yep, way because I don't have yeah. any other way of doing it. That's fine. You can just pass me that and then come on up. I'll need you up here, okay? Okay, it's it's covered in sawdust still. I haven't even done it yet. That's okay, just pass her up. You'll be at the bottom, not me. <laughs> yeah. I can't find the brush. I was hmm. looking. I was looking for it. Hmm. Well. Okay. Uh. What I'm going to need you to do without falling is it's got to be slid into there. Actually, you know what? No, I better. I better get you to hold that there. Now we'll go up here. Hey, guess who just on the lace again? These are a different pair of shoes even and they came undone. Good grief. Charlie Brown. Just tell me where about you want it and I'll hold it there. Hold on a second. Yep. Okie dokie. It's got to go up underneath these rafters. So we're going to take it here. We're going to slide it all the way down. See where the other one stops. See that? Yep, I do. How close are you there? Right there. That's, that's touching it. Okay. But it's going to have to be turned on its side, obviously. And then I need, this is going to have to be cut. No, it didn't. Slide her back in there. You measured this to make sure it was six inches? Um, you seem a little unsure. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I totally did. Hold oh. on. Hold on. It's just over six. So just over six, six is not... Sixteenths. This should work. Okay, can you get this Bessie clamp? I've got this. I need you to operate it down there. Okay, what do you want me to do? Clamp that in there. Nope. 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 Run it from underneath. Nope. Nope. In the middle. See this stud here? See in between the two studs I put in there just now? Yes, right here? Yeah, put it from underneath up. Open that up. Up as far as it'll go. Okay, that's as far as it'll go. Now tighten her up. You keep going on that, keep going. Okie dokie. Now, right, do you feel safe standing here like this, holding this? I think so. Okay, then come on up here. That's not going nowhere right now. Do not get your fingers in behind it. Okay. Hmm. 
will go in. Okay, keep holding that. I am. I'm gonna try it from the top now that's in there a ways. Where's that sitting there? Yeah, that's good. That's good like that. Hammer that in, tighten that up as I go. Are you like them apples? Yeah. Now, if you can hold on to that for a minute. Yep. I'm gonna go to the center here. Okay, now, that's all good there. This is gonna be need to be pulled up to be snug up here. Yeah. You can come down. I saw it doing nothing up there. Oh, okay. I didn't know if it would if no. it mattered or not. No, just come down where you're safe. So you see this here, this here, I have to fix this. I don't like the look of this. My nail bar, can you pass me it? It's underneath the... Uh, Pass you the, the nail bar. The, Please. Yeah, I'm gonna get you to take off another eighth or so inch off this. Okay. I'm gonna fix this first here. I might get it to take off. I'm gonna check it out here before, just so I know. Right here. Yeah. That makes more sense now. Don't want it. Is this up as far as it has to go? Yeah, that's good there. Now this here. I mean, that's... That's 
level right there. So it should be here and then here. That's why I couldn't get a good line on it before. Now, long side to long side, we are, look at that, 13 and just under 13 and three quarters. And would you have cut it before? I don't know, because didn't I cut that one a bunch of times? Did I have to yeah. keep cutting some off? Yeah, you did, but that's because I gave you the wrong measurement. I knew it was you. So, <laughs> it's just over thir 13 and 5 eighths, will do, or it should be close. 13 and 5 eighths. Okay. And I gave you a measurement, so we are 13 and 3 quarters, so 13 and 5 eighths. You want these pulled out, or can you handle it with those in there? I should be able to handle it with those in there. Okay, it'll meet you down there. It's down there already. Okay. <laughs> so 13 5 eighths. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. It'll fit better now. <clears throat> now this here had to be pulled up. In and up. I'll loop this over top. So if it lets loose, it's not gonna fall. <clears throat> no, that's gonna have to be pulled up. Okay, so stick a few here where it don't have to go up. up there good and tight. You see how good it fits there? See where the line is? Fits good. Fits good now? Lines up with the line top and bottom? Yep. Yeah. I'm glad I took that off and redid that because that would have bothered me. Totally. Me too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> you wouldn't have cared. <laughs> You're like, that's good enough. <laughs> Can't we just put OSB on? <laughs> With OSB and OBL, though. What's that? It's covered with OSB and OBL, though. Yeah. I almost did that and I thought, nah, man, it's... I don't like it. Okie dokie. It's gonna be a loud noise. Didn't want you to have to go change your underwear. That's always good not to have to do that. Yeah. more pair of nails here.
Alrighty then. Yeah. Okay, I gotta get in there, babe. I'm getting out of the way. This one might need to be readjusted too, right? The what, what? The one down there. Maybe. We're gonna see. I don't remember if that height was off. The thing I didn't like, Heather, was it was, it was the height of this one as well as the fact that it wasn't out, it was in too far because I didn't have anything to gauge it to. Yeah. Yeah, you totally know what I mean. I do. I think very shortly I'm gonna stop and have a drink. Okay, that is good there. I'm going to need that level go shortly. This right here? That would be the one. I'm going to get up here somehow. Or I can swing on this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. The opposite hand, though. Yeah, that was weird. It's not the hand I usually hand it with. But it worked. It's pretty good for your non-dominant hand. I had everything on me is dominant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta get this out of the way. Okay. Let moi see. Oh, I am also going to need a bet you. A level. I need Aaron level. Hmm? Mm hmm. Not Neville, Aaron level. That's his name. Okay. That's not weird. No. It's not weird to name things. Hmm? It's not weird to name things. <sighs> I named you. You don't know what your name is? I have a lot I don't of them from think you. you do. <laughs> I have a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, if that's it, can you hold Aaron level? Yep. <clears throat> yeah, we got to take off at least probably close to a quarter inch. There you go. I gave you the wrong. Measurement, I think. But I think while you cut that, I'm going to get a drink because I am dying of thirst. All this watching you walk up and down that ladder is tiring me out. Yeah, understandable. I would take off a quarter inch, Heather. Yep, will do. Okay, well, let's see what we've done here so far. Far and I'll show you why I stopped and did that. Now everything looks curved with this camera, but it's not. It's not curved at all. It's just the way it looks. I could switch to my big camera that has a perfect lens on it, but then it shakes too easy. So now that is running straight. This is running straight. And I had to put that piece in there because you see here, it has to join here to plate the outside and this here was in 
inch and a half too far and this one here is in a little bit too far but it doesn't matter because the OSB is going to come up and get nailed on here anyway. Don't want to fall down my my scaffold here. Next one now, so you see that one that we put on there, that top plate's a little thicker than, actually that was a little thin in two inch. That's probably like inch and three quarters or so, and that's two inch, so. Then I do, I think, one more, and then I can do my, so I think one more, it'll be close to four foot, if not, it will be this one that's four foot here, and then when this one here goes in, if it's four feet, then I'll put one in over there at the four foot high or whatever height it is, and then I'll run one across there, and then I'll put one underneath it to bring it up to the height. Okay, Heather's here, but I'm going for a drink. So yes, thanks. I just want to see if this well, we is... we will check it. Okay, can you hold this in? Yeah. Or do you want to see it? Well, I'll just, I don't really, I don't care who does it. I'm just gonna just need to know if I'm gonna need to bring it back down again. Seems like you think you need a lot from me. Nope, gotta line up with this line at the bottom here. Like that? Nope, nope, nope. Like this? See the line at the bottom? So move your hand. Right there. Yeah, I think I can work with that, Heather. That's good. Okay. Okay, set her down here then. And I'm gonna shut the camera off and let's go get a drink, okay? Okay. We're gonna change, change batteries in this too. All right. These GoPros, the batteries go dead real fast. Okay. I will put my belt back on and I'll get up here and see. Yeah, we already had that cut right, correct? Heather? Yes, that one's that one's been cut. I'll get up here and I'll give you a measurement for the other one. Sounds good. There's a lot of wasps hanging around out here. I'm not really a big fan of that, you know? Yeah, I know. I don't know what I'm gonna touch or grab and have them all come jumping out at me saying hello in not a very nice way. And of course, I gotta stand up and do this. Ah, to me getting all comfortable and stuff. Uh, hmm. Okie dokie. I'm gonna give you a little shorter measurement, okay? Okay. That out of my butt. My butt. Forty-six and uh, forty-two and an eighth. We're gonna take another measurement there because that. Uh, the long end, forty-two. Forty-two and eighth. Always the long end, baby. Okay. Yep. So all I'm going to give you now is a measurement for the long end. 42 and an eight. Mm. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Okie dokie. That has to go there. Ah. Uh, hold on, hold on. Is this the right lens? I think that might be okay. How come I can't go 30 degrees this way? Uh, you can only go one way, that's why, babe. It won't fold the other way. Yep, yep. I 
I know that socks and all, but that's the way they make them. Well, it won't even move now. There we go. What's that? I'm talking to myself. Okie dokie. But now no. I need to see this is... Hi. So what's happening? Nothing, I got it. Okay. Having a moment? I had to turn the board. Yep. What's that? Oh, I did something stupid. <laughs> what? You know. I know it's hard to believe. But I did. What was it? It's okay. <laughs> I got it figured out. I just gotta. What's that? I've got it figured out. I just have to fix something I did. Alrighty. a wasp's nest around here or something because they're everywhere oh yeah they're here pretty badly they're not liking the shaking and rocking and rolling their little house here If they stay on their side, I'll stay on my side and we'll all get along great. Yeah. But if they mess around too much, I'll burn their little building down. <laughs> Aren't you the tough guy? Well, they will see. Make sure that fits. Oh, yes. <clears throat> yeah, it seems to fit okay. All right. Um, we can, you can probably. Um, 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 you can probably measure the next one to make sure. Oh, I gotta nail this one in first. That's good. <sighs> I 
that's good. I'm going to draw a pencil line here just as a reference. So I know roughly where it's got to be. Yep, yep. I gotta lean over here without going bye bye. Rings on the ears a bit. Now this one. Huh. Oh. Oh. I think I'm gonna have to do it something like like there, I think. Give me guesswork. Oh. Boat there. There. Now let's see how long this needs to be. Let me over four feet. Like fifty six or something, maybe. I would say so. 57 right on. 57 right on. Yeah. That's the long side again, of course. Yeah, 57, babe, right on. So 57, that means then we'll be able to put our... Yeah. I'll have to see how high to go there. I can move this over now. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's level. I'll check it to be sure. I mean, it just has to be pretty close, but I'd like to be right on. If possible. <clears throat> Your purse. So that's how this is looking now. 
that's running straight up and down. And, oh, sorry. These are as well. I mean, oh, this lens makes it look funny because it's a GoPro, but uh, I think tomorrow I'll use the large camera for this. Should be able to see better, but. I'm gonna move this over here, so I wanna get a measurement. See how long it has to be. I'm gonna have to do something stupid here. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> oh, I didn't lock that. That would have been fun. Not really, but it would have been quite the ride. Okie dokie. This should be better now. Righty. Now, oh, I get it right here. Look at that. I didn't even have to climb up there. Okay, Heather, yeah, 44. 50, what? I'm gonna need one as well at 44 inches once you get that one down, okay? Okay, so 57 and 44. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah, see? All I had to do was measure it. I was going inside. I was gonna step out there to get this measurement right here. This measurement here, I'll show you. I didn't think I could see it from here, but it's stupid me. This measurement right here, from here to here, which is 44 inches. Oh wait, let me see Heather, before we do that, okay? Yeah, 44 is fine, I think, babe. That'll be good. 44. Okay. Uh, what you, oh, you're just cutting the 57 yeah. one now, right? Yep. Okay. Once you're done there, maybe we'll get you to go 44 and say... This one here seems to be a little short. So I'm going to check it from here to here. We're going to go 44. 44 and 5 8 Yep, so the square one will be 44 and 5 eighths. Okay, 44 and 5 eighths. Yeah. I think that's what it was. Like. 44 and 5 eighths. I think that's what it'll be. Because after this one, I can start putting in my horizontal piece and then you will have to lift this, build this scaffold up higher to do that. Mm, there's a screw that shouldn't be there. I'll grab that here. Yeah, 44 and 5 eighths, both square cuts. Yep. After this one, if so we're not gonna, yeah, so you can you can set it, the rest are all gonna be square cuts now. Okay. Until I get a little ways ahead here, but the rest are all gonna be just square cuts. Okay. Uh, that, is that 44 and 5 eighths or too short? I haven't, I, I'm gonna check, if not that one is, that looks like about 42 inches or something, 44. What is it? Won't work, but this one will. What, how long was it? 40, uh, 42 or yeah, something. Yeah, I thought, it, it, I thought, from up here it looked about like that, but I've been wrong once or twice. Okay, there. Now we're getting further away from the wall here. That's okay, I'll turn this here, so don't go rolling away on me. Alrighty. Uh, let's see what it's like here. 
Let's see any better for you folks. Let's see here. Uh -huh. well, let's see what this is like here. Okay. Let's see what I can do. Not sure if I went too long on this Heather. I'm gonna use it anyways. I'm not I'm not gonna bother taking it down, I don't think. I think I'll do it anyway. There's a 44 and 5 eighths. Okay, can you bring her up? Yeah, it's right here. Okie dokie. Yeah, so that has to go about there. Put a line there, that's good there. Okie dokie. I don't know. Well, that's pretty good anyways, Heather. Good. Um, sorry. I need two of them at 44 inches. 44 and 5 eighths. 44 and 5 eighths. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, one's got to go here. One's got to go at the far end. Okay, what about in the center? That don't matter yet. Okay.
Đỗ kỹ Well, I think you can see what's happening there now. Now, I had to put another one of these guys, these studs right here, over against that section of wall. And then I can run my horizontal plate on top of that. Oh, I didn't lock that one either, did I? Oh, yes, I did. I get it in. another I'll give you another measurement okay sure I'm sure hoping that this is going to be level here but I really don't have any way of knowing yet until until I put this one in And then I can give you a measurement across what I need. Okay. Heather? Yeah. No, I'll, I'll just... What's that? Nothing. I'm gonna give you a measurement here. What I need to go across this. I'm gonna need it. Ninety three and three quarters, okay? Okay. So you'll need a full eight foot piece. I'm out of eight footers. Tens? Yeah. Well, then just cut, ten. cut one out of a ten. That's all. I just meant like that's not going to work. Yeah, ninety. Because said, ninety-eight is eight feet. That's right. Okay, so you said ninety-three and what? Or ninety-six is eight feet. Do you need what size? I don't remember. I got to measure again. I think you said ninety-three and three quarters. Okay. But, but by the time you get one, I'll, I'll figure that out right here. Okay. Yeah, 93 and, well, just a little over three quarters. So 93 and, no, 93 and three quarters is a lot. And then once you cut that, then I'll know whether it's level or not. Yeah. Okay. I'll put this in here and then I'll know before I nail that one in, in case I have to adjust this one up or down. I wanna make sure that's running level. And I put that up real quick, but that security camera, that real link camera is gonna go on the outside, just underneath the uh, 
probably underneath the gable end. Okay, I'll get down here and I'll grab that once she cuts it. I like these shoes better for working around up here. That's good. They got a thinner sole and it's easier to uh, feel what I'm doing. Good. If this, if this is good, then I probably need three or four at that last 44 and whatever, I forget now. Five eighths. 44 and five eighths, okay. And this is three quarters. 93 and three quarters, this one. Yeah. And a mosquito just took a chunk out of my back. <sighs> Got away with a free meal. Got away with my royal blood. So the mosquito just got a free meal. Got away with a bit of my royal blood. So mm. they're gonna be blue bloods. Yeah, it's probably had the tastiest meal it's ever had. Hmm. Considering they only live for a few days, it probably is. Yeah. Of course it's the females, the only ones that bite. <laughs> We'll use that one up top there in a bit. We're gonna need some shorter ones up there anyways. That's okay, babe, just pass to me. I don't care about that. Got it? Yeah. I'll let you move so you don't get sawdust on you. Cause I'm a nice guy that way. Yeah, there's a bit of sawdust on there, Heather, that's for sure. Alrighty, so with any luck, this should span across that opening there. And with any luck, it's level as well. It's Aaron level. I'm gonna need to use Aaron level here. Oh, yes. Now let's see how close that measurement was I gave you. I'll drop this end in first and then lift this up here. Oh, look at that, eh? Either I give you the wrong measurement and you cut it good or I give you the right measurement and you cut it good or whatever. Okay. So 40, Either way. So 44 and 5 eighths, right? That's perfectly level. Good. Uh, yeah, what was, uh, you want me to measure to be sure? It was 44 and 5 eighths, the other ones, but I can do it. If you want to check just to see. Yeah, you're probably right. Look, I trust you totally. I'm gonna need at least three of them at that length. Okay. Is this safe? Probably not. Am I gonna do it? More than likely.
Oh. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Even that, it picked it up, didn't it? Hmm. That's what I'm going with, though. I tossed my square down there, didn't I? Yeah, do you need it? Yeah, if you don't mind. Yippers. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, has to come back my way a little bit. <clears throat> That's good. And then this here, feel like I don't drop it. That's good there. I am no professional carpenter. Yes, I would have had, loved to have windows at the end up here, but they're just so darn expensive. <clears throat> Can you pass me the level? Mm-hmm. Good. Okay, now the square, please. Thank you. That's good as well. And so is that. That's not pencil, please. I'll put a mark here just in case it moves up. Beauty. There's a bit more to do and then we start sheeting in the gable end here with OSB and then we start back on the roof. Yeah. Still against the line, that's good. The 
So 44 and 5 eighths. We'll remember that for tomorrow, right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> this and this and this i'm just setting these under here oh it's not supposed to rain so are you sure it looks like it. it doesn't matter it's under the scaffold anyways okay that scaffold don't leak okay but i'll take the the drill down yeah yeah yep for sure for sure all righty well this is how this is looking so far so we got that done there that done in this section so we only need two two or three more here We've got that all done there yeah two or three more sections here two more three more studs here then we only have to put in a few up there and then we start uh, sheeting it in with osb and once the osb is done then we start framing in the roof overhang here once this is all sheeted in, all down the other side, then I will measure out all the way up and down, and then I'll cut that off accordingly with a string line. Then I'll frame it, I have to put a piece of OSB up there just to fill that in. And then that will all get built out and framed in around here as well. I have to put a little piece in here as well, a little piece of OSB right there to match up with there, and a little piece of OSB here as well. And then once that's all done, it will look a lot better, I think. That camera up there is catching me moving. Right there, yeah. Now, once this is all done as well, I have to cut all of this off. And then we do, so we're gonna be working at the front here probably for, oh, I'll bet you another month or so or more to, once you sheet this all in, then we gotta frame all this in. The roof or hanging, we have to frame all that in. But it, it'll go good. It'll look a lot better once that's all closed in, won't it, Heather? The OSB's yeah. all up there. I'm gonna lay this camera, I'll just bring this over here, the tripod, I just stick a leg in here like this. There we go. That way it can't really go too far. I'm going to toss my shirt down to you, Heather. Stay there. Woo, take it off. <laughs> <laughs> it, woo, it was off. Yay. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna come down and see how it looks from down there. It may not look like it, but we're up here over 10 feet. Yeah, over 10 feet, so it'll be like falling off of a house roof with uh, two foot basement stick it out of the, the ground so that's what it's looking like down here now there that's what it's looking like and just that opening to fill in there and then frame it up there like we did over here you see that little section up there so this is the section I'm working on now right here that piece I have to frame this in and there's that piece up there like I said here and the OSB goes on the outside. And then we can continue framing, and like I say, the roof, and then put the tin on and the house wrap, and then strap it and do the siding on the front. Yeah. Okay, well, where's Heather? Okay. Anyways, that's about it for this evening, folks. Hope you enjoyed this. It's getting late, actually. It's starting to get dark out, and the bugs are getting friendly, so we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye, all. Bye.